Hello, welcome to the Black Sister Show. I'm Bella Tritz and I'm the Sissel. And today we're going to talk about the Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows trailer that has just come out and also our review of Inception. I really, really liked the trailer. I thought it looked pretty exciting. I got goosebumps and everything just watching it. I'm a little bit disappointed with the trailer. The film does look good, but I, I think it was more a trailer for how good a special effects team are and nothing else and like I've never been a fan of special effects divas blah 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 good done by I that. quite like it because it's I don't know it was kind of the idea that it's magic I thought I sort of feel like you need a lot of special effects in order for it to look good I think you do but in the trailer it was a little bit overkill I think they should point out the fact that there are other stuff in the film like hopefully there'll be some good acting and there's a real kick-ass storyline. I think they kind of ignored that and just like look everybody, it's a film where we blow shit up. And the really good bit I thought in her special effects was the ending. Oh yeah, Voldemort that was good. shot his wand up and this lightning bolt came up into the P. It was really cool. I like the new hardcore music. That dun, 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 yeah. Dun. Like, then Whoa. they've got two different. Um, musicians so the first part has a different yeah. one to the last one so it's going to be interesting interesting sorry to see I, how it varies i can't believe they brought john williams back to me john williams does the cheesy rubbish first two films and this is yeah. quite more mature and i think the audience have grown up enough now that i think they should move away from john williams yeah sort of bringing him back i think the last Together. film part two should have probably the dude that did the sixth one yeah it was really really dark and really sort of Nicholas on edge Hitchback. tension and everything he i really good. liked it i liked him inception we went to go see inception yesterday and um yeah it was good i thought i liked it i liked it i i thought it was gonna be better just because everyone has this massive wow inception thing going on and i just mm. imagine it to be far more complicated and sort of far more sort of like bottling in your mind and it was just to me and you as well it was quite sort of i didn't find it complicated at all i thought it was going to blow my mind i thought i was going to be confused but i wasn't confused i was confused at the end because i thought i'd missed something to make it more confusing yeah that's why that i thought like, i'd missed something because that was too simple mm. but i got that too easily well like the idea isn't simple but like the way it was portrayed was so well that you understood yeah. it so it yeah. was simple in that sense you know they do caprio surprised me a little bit don't really rate him much as an actor like i used to like him because he's a little bit sexy but now i actually think he's quite a good actor i'm impressed <laughs> okay i never really thought he was sexy but um <laughs> no yeah. he's he's definitely got a lot better in acting i think he's really convincing these days i think mm. well like he's like you said yesterday now that he's not as hot anymore you have to focus on the acting <laughs> yeah. maybe it was there all along this girl from juno as well in it she was good I'm surprised they picked her actually. In such a weird storyline, you thought you'd pick someone other than Juno Girl, but proves that she can act. Overall, really good film. Not quite as mind boggling as I thought it would be, but um, awesome effects and stuff. And I really thought the storyline was very original. And it was. it was a good film. It was a good film. I reckon it's going to win some Oscars. On a final note, a friend of mine at university has asked me, and I personally think it's an amazing charity, um, to recommend Practical Action. If you go to practicalaction.org, um, it can tell you all about it. It's basically trying to tackle poverty, particularly by the use of technology and things like that. And um, there's one page where you can send in your face and um, then you join in with all, everyone else's faces and it's just a really nice experience to be part of and I'd really recommend you get involved. Thank you for the comment in the last video, we felt the love. I know, my Thank god, you. there was like a million in one night, I was like wow! Really really wasn't expecting that so well done for your ranting and thank you so much for your comments. Keep it coming, Anna, we love you. We love you so much. <laughs> Bye YouTube. Bye Tooby Tooby. Ha, 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 ha.